I, oh my, sorry about that. Okay, so I've just dealt with my children again. Um, okay. That's my son, Oren. They don't seem to care when you're trying to do something. So if you don't have kids, be prepared for it. I love my kids. I do. <sighs> okay. But, okay, so in my last video, I told you that I was either going to do my Ipsy Glam Bag or my Birch Box. And I decided to go with my Ipsy Glam Bag because I got it first. Now, I must warn you. Um, I opened it. I got it days ago. Um, I believe I got it on Monday, to be exact. Um, I liked everything in it, just saying. Obviously, because I'm about to tell you, one of the items I had, I put in my purse and I took it to work with me. And because it's just, I really liked it a lot. And I put it on my desk and I left it there when I was sleeping. So I won't get to show that to you, but I can show you a picture of it. And I'm not sure how good it's going to come up on my YouTube webcam thingy. I'm sorry. I'm not one of those people who has big camera that flashes and shows all their good sides, you know. Um, so I'm just going to jump right into it. First off, with my Ipsy bag, it came in this cute, shiny bubble wrap bag and I was just like that is adorable I mean it's just so girly and I loved it okay but this is empty obviously I already took it out I just wanted to show you the packaging now the bag okay so the bag here it is you can see that it says ipsy all over it which is cute. I mean, I would, I would totally put stuff in this and carry it in my purse or my makeup bag, whatever. I mean, it is a makeup bag, but it's a very tiny makeup bag. So I would be a makeup bag within my makeup bag. Sorry, my daughter's on the floor and I just want to make sure she's okay. <laughs> like I said, this is makeup and mama. Anywho, this is the back. It doesn't have anything. It is a different material. I can't really just tell you what what material um no I mean it's stretchy it is stretchy but not like that <gasps> that's stretchy it's not that kind of stretchy but it, it feels like the bag could expand if I tried to stick several things in it and then the top of it of course the pretty coral color right there I liked that it's just like bam a dash of color okay but let's get into this bag First thing I noticed is when I reached my hand in, even on the first time, was the card. And it is super cute. Oh, sorry. Super cute, okay? Look at that. They put some work into that. They did. And I just love her makeup. I, it's not something I would wear. And it's, it's not, I'm not prejudiced against it. I just, I'm more of a kind of natural flow kind of girl. If I'm going to go bold, it's not going to be this sorry but it's totally cute on her and I just mm, it's so cute anywho it says swim into beauty ipsy and then on the back just keep swimming and then it talks a little bit and then tells you how to win a subscription to the glam bag for a year Ooh, lovely which I've done all of this okay so you've got the card then you reach in and I'm just going to pull up first thing. Okay, so my Formula X nail polish. Well, nail color, but I call it nail polish. And it, I, it's, of course, just a little sample, but it's so cute. I love tiny bottles of nail polish. Mind you, I don't paint my fingernails because I go and get my nails done. And I don't know about you, I'm not taking my own nail polish. Um, So... I always pick my toes though, so I will definitely be using this on my toes. Isn't this just adorable? It's so dang cute. So cute. I don't I wonder what it smells like. Like have you ever got the nail polish that like has a smell? It smells like nail polish. It doesn't have like a fruity kind of smell. So I mean I like I don't know where I bought them, but I got some nail polish a long time ago that they just smelled so good. They didn't smell like nail polish. She found my computer bag. 
I'm just kidding. Very not nourishing break, except for maybe my mouse. Um, okay, but back to this. This is a Formula X nail color. I've heard about this brand like a couple times, and from what I've heard, it's a pretty expensive brand, but it's good nail polish. And me personally, if it's a good nail polish, it's going to last, it's not going to chip. I washed the dishes one time and bam, it's off my nails. I don't know if y'all have that problem, but I do, and especially because I have really moist hands uh, and my, my fingernails are really brittle, so they'll bend and I just, it's got to be a good nail polish, especially if it's going to cost a lot. But it just, I love this color. It's really cute. Let's see. Can you see? Can you see? Can you see? Can you see? I mean, it's kind of a coral, a coral color. From here, this, my perspective, it actually matches the lining. Pretty good, except for this has more of like a pinky tone. Um, so I'm definitely excited about this. Okay. So there's that. It's item one. Then, this was really cool. I'm a big fan of eyeliner. To be truthful, I don't wear a lot of makeup, um, but I really wanted to explore new brands. And maybe if I found something, I might start actually using quite a bit of it. It's just I don't know what to use. I don't know what I'm going to like. I don't, I have a combination skin. Sometimes my skin is dry. Sometimes my skin is oily. So I really try to keep my minimum to my makeup to a minimum keep my minimum. Good job me. Okay. So, sorry if you mess with my nose. I'm actually kind of sick and I've been sick for like a week and a half. Thanks to my daughter. But it's okay. That's what my mommy's about. So, let's get to this eyeliner. First off, it is this pretty coral color. Well, that is the example of the color. And it actually represents the color very well. Okay. And it's by Ofra. And I believe that's how you pronounce it. Sorry if that's not. So I'll just show it to you. <coughs> Keep my fingers still. I wasn't aware my hand shook so bad. Okay, well, I'm going to stop doing that because obviously I can't hold it still enough. Well, now I've got it upside down. Ha! Mm, there we go. See? It says Ofra. OFRA, okay? And it's in the color turquoise. Now, I'm not going to lie. Normally, I'm a straight black. That's all I use. And I only do it on my, my uh, tear eye or waterline. That's what it's called. I was like, tear eye? What am I talking about? And you're probably like, um, what the heck is a tear eye? <laughs> well, it's when your eyes tear up. <laughs> okay. So, and it's an eyeliner. Now, and like I said, I really only go for black, but I've always wanted to branch out, but I never wanted to buy it because I didn't want to buy a color and then not like it and be wasting my money, and I can't return it because I've used it and opened it. So to be able to try a new color to see if it's something that might look good on me, I'm really super excited about. But let's get right into the description. So of course I've already tried this, not on my eyes yet. Um... I wanted to wait till I didn't have to work. That way I could actually do my face and everything because I have two kids. And when I get up in the morning, I'm not doing much to myself. I'm going to make myself look presentable, but I'm not going all out for it. You know, I just want to get dressed, look decent, have a fresh face, go to work, get home and die. <laughs> but that's just me. Like right now, now, I'm sure you can tell I have no makeup on except for mascara. You see them eyebrows? Look at them eyebrows. they barely any eyebrow. Wow. They're really. Okay, let's let, let's ignore my eyebrows. I really look like I don't have any. You can always draw some in with some turquoise, you know. You'll really see some eyebrow. <laughs> okay, so it is a turquoise. You can really see it. It's super cute. Um, it's glittery. I like it a lot. That's what it looks like on my hand. Um, and you can't see it very well. Super sorry. But it's really cute. 
And, and what I like about it is that it blends. And sometimes I've been known, like, with a black eyeliner, if I'm just looking for, like, a, a simple look, I will actually use my eyeliner as an eyeshadow. I'll do my line, and then I will blend it out until it gets lighter. And then I'll redo a line to make sure that I actually have what looks like eyeliner on. So that's just me, and I don't know if anybody else does that, but I do. But super psyched about this. Can't wait to try it. Okay, and next in the bag, we have Smashbox Photo Finish Foundation Primer. Ooh, that's a mouthful. It is oil-free. Cool. Yeah, that is really cool. Okay, so I have bought a primer before, and to be honest, I didn't like it. I already have somewhat of an oily tech face. Like right now, it's ultra oily because I put this morning after I cleaned my face, um, I put on Olay Regenerate something, this little red bottle thingy, and I, I just put it in certain areas but over the course of the day of course I went like this so it's like all over my face now Ooh, gross you know I'm just kidding okay so I have not put this on my face yet and it's only because I haven't been doing my makeup obviously it's a trial size it's not for sale um but, I mean, really, this is super cool because if I don't like it, there's not that much, and I don't have to worry about a big, big bottle being wasted. There's nothing worse than wasting a product. And definitely, if you have subscription boxes and you decide you don't like an item, find a friend. I'm sure they will love it. And really, like, three of these products will pay for the box. So, if there's, like, two you don't like, just give them away. Somebody else will love them. Or, or, or save them all up and give them to somebody for, like, their birthday or something. That would be super cool. Oh, here you go. <laughs> Here's a whole bunch of makeup. Um, some of it you might not like, but what you don't like, give away to. <laughs> okay, so right into it. I have put this on my, my hand, and right off the bat, I can tell you, it is a really good formula. You don't have to use a lot, and it kind of feels, hmm, I'm trying to think of what it feels like as you're putting it on. It's not oily. It, it feels oily at first, but it's not. That's the thing. It's like so smooth. It's kind of ridiculous. And it sinks into your skin, which is a plus. You never want things to just sit on top, ever. Like this stuff that I put on my face this morning, it sat on top. It really didn't sink in, which is why I was able to smooth it all over this way. <laughs> It would probably help if I would stop touching my face like that. But, so, I'm really excited for the next time that I actually do my makeup all out to be able to use this. So, thank you, Ipsy. Totally worth this. Oh, excited about that. Okay. And the last thing that's in the bag, uh, besides the picture that I have to show of the item that I left at work, is these Trez Dick. Okay. Mm. I'm not really sure how to pronounce that. Tre Stick. We'll go with that. That sounds really good. And, um, nice. <laughs> um, it is a mini crayon, mini shadow crayon in Kona Coffee. This is awesome. Okay, so if you know me, you know. If I don't wear a lot of makeup, obviously when I do wear makeup, I'm more into natural colors like brown and tan, maybe throw in a little bit of orange, like the color of my lips, I'll do that. Um, so I don't go I don't go hard on my eyeshadow, just saying. I don't have any on right now. Mm. It looks like it, but that's just because my eyes are super dark. You see them bags? You see this? You see this? Ipsy? Send me something to help with this. Send me something. Help me. Okay, so it's, I mean, I'll get pretty good use out of that, uh, as long as it doesn't break while I'm trying to use it. Um, if, hopefully you don't stick it all the way out when you're trying to use anything. I've never used something like this, so this is pretty cool. Yeah, this is really cool. And I like the packaging. It literally looks like a crayon. 
Like I'm going to color and let's do you know, okay, that's that's cool. Oh, let me let me show you the color, okay? So you see that it's a nice dark brown, yeah. Um do 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 you see that? Yeah, get excited. Okay, so those are the items that are left in my bag, and now I'm going to show you the picture of this. So I also received this, uh, you can't see it very good. Ah uh -huh, yay! Okay, this, the Healthy Body Butter by, um, La Vanilla Laboratories. I wish you could see this better. I'm so sorry. I know this is crappy, and it'll never happen again. I just, I just randomly decided on my way home, hey, I think I want to make videos. Ha ha ha. Okay? So, excuse my first one. Forgive me. Okay. So, OMG, I loved, 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 loved this lotion. Normally, I have a big problem with lotions because... They make me feel oily, and every time I touch myself that I put it, it gets on my hands, and then my hands get greasy, and it makes me not want to wear lotion because of this. Oh, goodness. Oh, oh, and speaking of, let's, let's revert back to that eyeshadow. Blends beautifully. Very pigmented. Oh, I'm so excited to use that, too. Yay! Okay, so back to that. Um, I was able to rub it in real good, and it soaked in. It made that area I put it really soft. So I threw it in my purse. I was like, I like this. Oh, yeah. Yeah, this is going to work. <laughs> so I'm disappointed. I, I, and, oh, the smell. Lord, the smell. It's If you like vanilla, you will love this formula. If you're not a fan of vanilla, advise buys it because it's very very strong but I mean I loved it okay so those were my things and my ipsy bag and you can hear my son he thinks I'm talking to myself it's a crazy idea um so comments below um give me some advice what are you looking for me to say I mean I'm giving you my honest opinion first off I'm not a beauty guru. I'm doing this video with nothing on my face. But that's just me. This is how I looked all day. All I had on mascara. And this morning I did put on some stuff on my eyebrows just to make the ends here a little more. Bam. I've got something there because they look terrible. But I never do anything about the, the bags under my eyes. Look. I work. I got two kids. Like it, leave it, don't care. But, anywho, I really hope you enjoyed this. Um, I think on my first video, I want to ask a question, and any answers will be really appreciated. So, my first question for you guys is, and I will post the top five ones on my next video. Probably next week, because I don't really know if anybody's really going to watch this. Yet, um, I'm not gonna like doing like some, some promoting. Um, but eventually, I will. I mean, heck, if I get enough followers, yeah. If you like how I explained my items, if you like me, um, come view my pages. Here, you're gonna find a little bit more I decided than just my boxes and my bags. I'm going to tell you about my life. Welcome to the world of Ashley. It's a really dramified story, you know? I'm just kidding. It's not really. But, yeah. I'm going to give you some tips. Um, I'm not going to be your beauty beauty queen. Definitely not going to be that because that is not me. That's one of the biggest reasons I'm trying these uh, boxes and bags because I'm hoping I find my gorgeous girly self. <laughs> <coughs> I think I'm about as girly as I can get right now. Okay, but anywho, thanks for watching, like my page, like this video, show it to your friends, and come back. It's as simple as that. All right, bye.